Yo, world, this is Batman DD1. Yo, what's happening, everybody? So check this out. Marvel. I don't know what is with Marvel fans, but every time I talk about Marvel, there cannot be a reason but now. So I fucking hate and love Marvel fans to death, but y'all niggas need to stop bitching. I believe Marvel fans are pissed off because Marvel has never done something so big and prolific. So, Netflix. Everything on Netflix is because of this. The Defenders. Everybody's waiting for the Defenders. Everybody's waiting for them to just come together like the Avengers. But nobody knows how to really wait for shit to happen. But the one thing that is getting more talk than all of the Defenders, more than Daredevil, more than Jessica Jones, is Iron Fist himself. Nobody's talking about the black guy. Nobody's talking about the black guy. They're like, oh, they got Luke Cage. They got it. Marvel's done edgy and hardcore shit before. Marvel Max and Marvel Maximum or Marvel Max itself is where all the like profound, like dark, prolific shit from Marvel was before. Now, I take it to another extent. I think fans don't want to sit the fuck down and chill out. Marvel's doing so much to make fans happy that they had to dispel a whole bunch of rumors. Down the links below, Joe Quesada or Joe Quesada, like Quasant, even talks about, like, all right, like, we're not making Iron Fist into a movie. We're making him into a TV series. There was The Man with the Iron Fist, but RZA's movie, first one, was good. The second one was, eh. But let me not get into that right now. It's not about RZA. It's about Iron Fist. The real, immortal Iron Fist. We get into the understanding that Joe Quesada was like, Oh, if it's on the internet, yeah, it must be true. No, it's not. If Marvel didn't come out and tell you, it's not true. Marvel themselves know what the dealio is. People don't understand. I'm scared for Iron Fist 2 because I'm a big Iron Fist fan. Martial arts, all of that. If they're gonna do the character right, do him right. They finally got a director to show run this shit. He's the same guy that made Dexter and a whole bunch of other things. In the links below, the article talks about everything Marvel's been doing up to now. There's two articles and also something that's getting me a little scared is the martial arts choreography. Since Netflix just launched the trailers of, what was it, what was it? Um, it's on the tip of my tongue and I hate that. I'll get back to that. Since Netflix launched a new trailer for Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon, Sword of Destiny, they launched that new trailer and that new trailer is getting so much buzz. But the choreography in that trailer, Donnie Yen in that trailer, or is it Jet Li? Whoever's in that trailer, I watched it. And I was like, the choreography, the martial arts, it's going to be an amazing movie or series or whatever. But it's going to be amazing. Now, I'm worried about the real Mort Iron Fist. And links below, again, look at the links in the description and, you know, read the article. Because the article tells you what you want to hear. Basically, Danny Rand comes back home to you know to, to new york city and he's been like presumed dead for a long time so his company is obviously in the hands of somebody they're going pretty hard with the comic if you read the iron fist comic you know what happens to danny rand and his family long story short they're looking for the lost city of kung lao and danny rand's father's partner betrays them his father dies his mother gets eaten by wolves it's a whole like oh my god and danny rand is training kung lao long story short goes back to you know new york city gets revenge and the guy is like old and has cancer or some shit whatever but there's other comic books that talk about the deeper dark more like deadly shit in the iron fist world and that takes it to another place now i'm worried because marvel is just like Kicking rumors out the fucking window, like, get the fuck back, bitch. Like, they're doing jobs. They're, they're doing it good. But why? Because fans won't chill out. Nobody's worried about Luke Cage like I am. But fans, Marvel's doing it just the way you like it. Unlike DC, uh, we may have seen too much of the Batman v Superman trailer, in my case, but we've seen enough. We've seen enough. You know, no more trailers. Show what you want to show, and that's it. I got ruined by Jessica Jones, and... That video is coming soon. Not soon as you think it is. It's coming soon. I just can't can't collect all my thoughts at once. I watched them straight through. So I'm Fat Man DD One. Tell me in the links below. I um, mean the doobly doo, the descriptions, the, the the comment section. What do you want from the man with the iron fist? I mean, I mean the immortal iron fist. Tell me what you think. Tell me what the series should have. Tell me what you think they're gonna put in and take out. 
tell me what from the comics that you think the Iron Fist is. And do you think Marvel's doing a good job with the Netflix series and doing a good job with the rumors and dispelling them? Let me know. Peace.